This is Robert Kraft, and I'm coming to you live on SNN Live, and we're at the LD Micro Main Event 2019 in Bel Air, California. With me right now is Todd Davis from CBD Unlimited, publicly traded company, the symbols EDXC. Todd, welcome back. Good to see you. Robert, good to be here. Let's talk. Let's talk. So before we get into our updates, and you know, because it's been a few months here, let's get an overview. What does the company do? And we'll go from there. Okay, CBD Unlimited is actually one of the pioneers in the CBD industry. Uh, we started in 2014 in earnest with the pilot program that was approved by the federal government. Uh, we started at that time, rather than being growers or processors, uh, we started off doing clinical trials, not in the FDA's format, but really to figure out dosing, what the nutritional value was, what the therapeutic value of CBD was, and then with that science and with that testing, we built an entire product platform on that. So in 2015, we launched our products, and we've been growing that business ever since and, and really taking the market by storm right now by having that experience. So we last had you on here actually six months ago, and, and we also spoke to you at this conference about a year ago. So I figured let's get an update, maybe some of the highlights from the last six months to a year other than this brand new beard. <laughs> okay. Well, the highlights are this. We, you know, a year ago, we were sitting just less than a thousand stores. We were coming out of the pilot program. I think I had mentioned that I thought that the farm bill would pass in some time in December, and I think it was literally three days later. So at the onset of the new farm bill, this made it legal nationwide to sell CBD products. And my target last year, and what we talked about on the last uh, interview, was we would be in over 5,000 stores by this time next year. Well, we hit that mark in September. So when I say 5,000 stores, we're not talking about individual mom and pop stores. That's where we were before. We were with mom and pop doctors, professional practitioners that were early adopters using CBD in their practices. And now we've graduated into big box stores. So we're in two of the leading uh, Fortune 50 pharmacies that you can go to your local town drugstore and get. And we have two products in there right now. We, they started off with topicals. It's kind of the least risky way to get into the market and be a major retail there. So when I say topical, it's a skin product, something you apply f on the top of, top of your skin. 5,600 stores is where we're at today. So we exceeded and surpassed what we, uh, we had targeted for the end of 2019. This time next year, we're going to be in probably over 20,000 stores, and we'll be in, in the biggest board names that are out there today. So that really has been the progression of the year. We, we scaled up everything. We certified everything from a manufacturing standpoint. Being in a Walgreens or a CVS or any of the majors, you have a whole different audit cycle, whole different level of accountability. That is what we strove for early in the year, and that's what we executed and delivered on this year. So, well, firstly, congratulations. Thank you. And I have to ask, because I, haven't, I didn't get a chance to ask this on our last interview, is what would you say makes the company different and unique compared to some of these other CBD companies out there that you know, are, are selling similar products that you are? Science and compliance. So a, last year, in the early stage, we'll go back to what, I, what the overview of the company is, we did dosing trials. We didn't do it to see if we could cure anything. We wanted to know what the dosing range of any type of product that had CBD in it would require to generate a therapeutic value. Having that science, having that knowledge, it's just basic applied science. We recruited doctors, we recruited patients. We did this for animals and we did it for humans. We tested diabetic patients with diabetic neuropathy. So these are general, very discouraging and very painful conditions that people have. And in mass now with the, the, the onset and the, the proliferation of diabetes nationwide. So the results we got were fantastic. You know, on average, our, our patients under the doctor's care were achieving 65 to 68 percent pain reduction of diabetic neuropathy. What pharmaceutical product does that? So the way we got to the dosing is we started at low dosing and we worked our way up until we found average therapeutic value across the platform. Now we had to turn that science into manufacturing. And then we had to turn that manufacturing into compliance. In the early stages, we didn't have anything to comply to. So we used general over-the-counter medicine practices and pain practices. What would it take to sit in the pain aisle at a major pharmacy? So that's the compliance platform we built, and that's what we executed on this year. F having that background, knowing dosing, knowing the science behind CBD, has made us an expert in the field on 
what works and what doesn't work in the market. And then from what you can tell us, what would you say are some of the company's value catalysts now moving into 2020? For us, it's going to be two things. It'll be expanding our store count. So we're trying to keep a balanced approach to how we're attacking the market. Through influencers, through marketing, through advertising, we are moving into the store counts and expanding in that space. This year, our target is 20. And for 2020, it'll be 20,000 stores. We could get as high as 50,000 next year. We don't know for sure, but 20 is our conservative number. That's where we believe we can sit comfortably. And then on top of that is our e-commerce platform. We're going into an area where we can now influence markets. Uh, we can bring influencers of new products into the market. And we can start getting this expanded into multiple different markets other than just seniors or just athletes. This can be a broad spectrum treatment tool that doctors can use. The, the government has contracts that are coming up for bid. So we'll be going into spaces that did not exist a year ago and we'll be a leader in that space. And where can our audience go and find more information about CBD Unlimited? Go to cbdunlimited.com or you can call us at 480-999-0097 to find out more about the products if you're interested in something like that. But from a Wall Street standpoint, cbdunlimited.com, we have our Twitter and our Facebook pages that carry most of our up-to-date activity and you can really stay on top of the company. My name is Robert Kraft, and I'm coming to you live on SNN Live, and we're at the LD Micro Main Event 2019 in Bel Air, California. With me again, Todd Davis from CBD Unlimited, publicly traded company. The symbol is EDXC. Todd, always a pleasure. Robert, good to see you. Good to see you, too.